Hey guys, uh, another wrestling uh, tutorial for you. So we're just going to be going over like basically the mat work uh, this time. So we're going to start with, if you've got a wall, use a wall because then you can use that uh, for your partner, okay? as your partner. Uh, if not, it's fine, you can still uh, you do this. So we're in a, our wrestling referee's position, okay? Now, if you're thinking of jiu-jitsu, it would be more in a elbows tight, looking to where our opponent is, okay? But we're gonna be standing up. So from here, it's a lot easier to be standing up. Obviously, we don't get choked in wrestling, so we're not worrying about this. This is why we take this position uh, for jiu-jitsu, okay? From here, I'm looking that on this side of my body, I'm gonna step up, the same leg and getting this elbow away because they're controlling this elbow. This hand is going to grab onto them. As I stand up, I square up and I put one leg forward. Now both hands are going to come and start to peel that grip. As I peel, I'm going to put one in my pocket and then turn myself in. Okay, let's go down the mat here. Good. And then get ready and then we fire up. One. I square up. Two. Here, here, here. Peel and turn. Okay. Yeah, yeah, good, good. Well, bad posture, but good posture for the, the referee's position. Yeah, exactly. Bang. Yeah. Elbow away, grab the hand, square up, one leg forwards, stop peeling, peeling, hand in the pocket, behind you, turn, in, ready to rest. Okay? Do a few more. Yeah, fire up, one, good. Then we're going to stand up, square ourselves up, one leg forwards, hands, peel, peel. Okay, let's do a couple more. Referee's position. Here, set up. One. And here. Two. Peel. And go. Okay, let's do three more. Ready? Let's go. One. Sit, peel the hands, get up, turn, pull in the back pocket, and down. Back down to the mat. Do it again. Let's go. And up. Turn. Peel. Two. Yeah, and up, pull, and three. Okay, so that's what we call like our technical stand up uh, from that position. Okay, next thing we're gonna go through is our peak out. So we're still in our referee's position here. Okay, again, this can work from a turtle position here. And this is when they're not grabbing our head necessarily, their arms are both around our armpits, so we've got space to peek out. Okay, and I'll show you the more mobile way to this later. So here, or here, I don't mind looking to where they are, or here, nice and strong, okay? What I'm gonna do here is step out with one leg and look to come through their arm there, pull, okay? As I do that, I keep the sling knee nice and tight. Nice and tight, get a nice good uh, posture, I'm almost hot posturing back with them, okay? I'm not putting my bum on the floor, like you see, I want a big posture back there, and I look to turn it, okay? Now I've got that back, so from here, here we go. One, back through, okay? Back through, okay? Okay, try both sides. So if I go the other side, I'm gonna be going up with one leg, shooting through, keeping knee tight, keeping good posture, then coming back in, okay? Square. Here, let's go left. Let's go right. Start spinning up a little bit in your own time. Good, try it. Boom. Really pop yourself out. Boom. Pop yourself out. If you're doing it from here, you ought to be pulling this leg here, out. Boom. Posting on the mat almost. And then, boom. Driving yourself through that gap. Okay. Give me 20 more seconds there. Keep going left, right, left, right, left, right. Keep going, keep going. 10 more seconds. And time, okay. So we're gonna start with the shoot. A lot of these things might come from a failed shoot. So 
if I shoot, ah, gone for my takedown, there's sprawled on me, but I want to get to that referee's position first, okay? Initially though, we've got something that we call bear crawl or bear escape. It's, it's where we're shooting, I shoot here, boom, and then as they sprawl, I'm looking just to come up to a bear crawl and just start wriggling my way out and biting the, the hands, okay? So, I want to see you shoot here, they're going to sprawl, I don't mind your hands initially come to the mat, but me, I want you to fire up, and then you can use hands and your movement to like pummel the hands off your head, okay? This will be my initial escape, just like getting the hands up too far. So I'm here, bang, bang, go to my referee's position, I fire up, I start doing what I call the crazy bear. Yeah, so I shoot. That's it, ah, they sprawl on me, I get to a good, good solid position, otherwise I'm going to get slammed on, and then I fire up, and I just start getting rid of those hands on my head, okay? Let's keep working, try that one, the shoot into the crazy bear crawl, okay? Let's try that, good. Give me 20 more seconds. Oof, it's hot work. 10 more seconds. And time, okay. So from this shoot, boom, I failed. I come to my referee's position. I want you to either choose to stand up or choose the peak out. Or feel free to do the last one we just did. Maybe they haven't got good sprawls, so we're just looking to bear crawl ourselves away. Okay? Let's go. It's gonna go two minutes, those three exercises. So I shoot. Fail my shoot, come to my referee's position. Okay, I can either go bear crawl. I can go peek out from that position. Good, they run to my back, keep nice and tight, I feel. Okay? Fundamental escapes from that turtle position. All from a failed shoot, or however you get to that turtle position right here. Ah, boom, you shoot the peak out, boom. Good, I can stand up, boom. Or I can bear crawl, ah, ah, ah. okay? Let's go, keep working, keep working, let's go. Got one minute, 10 seconds. Keep shooting. I want you guys going faster than you're watching me do here. I'm really doing it for your technique. Here, here's a shoot, get sprawled on. I keep my good back, so I don't want to get my hands, oh, pull it right. I go to my back, Ooh. bang, hand up, peel, turn it. Yeah, I peek out, loose, from back square, took their back, or you shoot, and then we can bear pull, getting the hands and the head, fighting back up to our initial position, okay? Keep working, let's go 40 seconds. 40 seconds. Ooh, let me get my coffee. That's it. 30 seconds, keep working. Twenty seconds. And time. Good. Okay. So Let's, uh, if you've done the first wrestling class, we've done a double leg, a sweep single, uh, a high crotch, okay? I want you to put this into play now. We've got a three minute round. So if you're going for a double leg, maybe using the snatch or the arm drags, go for my double leg, or I'm going for my sweep single. That leg comes in. Good, standing up, running my single, high crotch. Choose a couple that you know, if you know all of them, great. And then we had a sprawl that we did in the first class as well. So sprawling, when we sprawl in this round, I want you to be turning straight to the back. When you turn, remember you've got to block the hand. So I want to see you blocking and then turning around to the back, okay? Then adding a failed shoot. So if I fail my shoot, oh crap, good look to pick out. So we're looking to add it our offense with our, our defense, okay? I think everyone's got it. We got five seconds until we go. So we got high crotch, single, double leg, sprawl, spin, 
on the mat. Let's go, start working on the mat. We've got stand up, uh, we've got peek out, and we've got the crazy bear crawl. Let's go. Make, make it look like you're wrestling now. I'm gonna shoot, Ooh. I'm gonna try to finish my doubles. Ooh. Good, I'm gonna shoot, I'm gonna fail my doubles. Oh, I'm gonna peek out, and I'm gonna do it super quick. Maybe they still got my head, so I'm gonna wrap around, okay? At the start, arm drags, snap downs. From the first uh, tutorial, same side hand, bicep, rip. boom, tricep, rip. pull it across. Step, 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 pull them down, okay? Keep working. Tip, bow, snap, into a double leg, boom. Inside control, get that sweep single, Ooh. then on the inside, stand up, fire in, high crotch, double leg. Ooh, I fail my shoot, oh no, you get out, maybe I stand up. Good, add them together. You might do two or three, I might be bad pulling. I might have to peek out, they might run to my back, I might have to stand up, Ooh. and then turn in, okay? Be as creative as you want. Let's work. Good, you're halfway nearly, halfway. Keep working, keep working. Keep working, stance as well, stance and footwork from the first one, arm drag, snap down, tricep, tricep, shoots. My double leg stepping up to the same side. Arm drag, maybe a sweep single, standing up, single leg, snap down, double leg. Good, shooting on them, pulling around. Two. And on the mat, you fail that takedown. Looking to peek out, looking to stand up. Oh, good, bear crawl now. Maybe they take my back. Well, we peek out here, then they start taking my back. That's it, one way, turn it. Okay, keep working. We've got 45 seconds. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Pump through. Keep that work. So, three minutes is a long time to be wrestling, but it's great for there's no, no physical impacts. This is good. So, I've still got my knee pads on, it still hurts. Keep going, keep going. Let's go 20 more seconds, 20 more seconds. Keep working, keep working. 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and time. Good, okay. Last thing again, at the end of every wrestling class, uh, we put Roxanne onto it, okay? So every time Sting says Roxanne, you sprawl, you shoot, or you do both, okay? So you've got a lot there to, to work on. Uh, make sure you do the tutorial one first, especially if you've never done anything before, and then come back to this one. This will give you some idea of the movements. If you can't do the movements, then you'll never be able to do it uh, in the sparring or when, when you're rolling wrestling, okay? I uh, hope you enjoyed those ones. Short, fast workouts, but do them quick. They're gonna be a good workout for you. Oosh.